Hi, Kiahi Palayo here, and today I'm going to take a huge risk. And I generally don't talk politics, and I'm not talking politics today, but I'm going to apologize in advance to those of you who might take it as me discussing politics. You saw that the title of today's video is The Trump Bump. And I can tell you that Today, because we have two parties running for the President of the United States, and I know some of you will say technically three, but the likelihood it's, is that the President is going to come from one of those two parties, I think we have to realistically lay out what might happen if Trump were elected President. And this was spurred by an interview that I saw of Kevin O'Leary of Shark Tank fame. He's a billionaire investor. And Maria Bartolomo was interviewing him and asking him why Elon Musk and Bill Aikman, two, Bill Aikman, I'm sorry, two well-known billionaires have recently endorsed him. And Kevin O'Leary said it's about one thing, and that's making money. Billionaires want to make money. And he believed that the endorsement by these two billionaires and others is because they believe his policies will allow them to do better business with less regulation and make more money. And it occurred to me that I've been um, bearish is the word that I would use, <clears throat> bearish on the interest rate environment and on the market uh, for a while. And it occurred to me that I could be wrong if Trump is elected. And here's why. Kevin O'Leary said that Trump has a history of deregulating, of lowering the barriers to entry in business and making it easier for business to thrive. And if Trump is elected and because markets are driven by what I'm going to call psyche, by our attitudes, if we believe that something is going to be bad, guess what? It becomes bad. And if Trump puts policies in place that leads to a better business environment, optimism that there's going to be more jobs, um, positive attitudes that if I risk my money to buy a house or build a business, I'm going to succeed, then, then it becomes a self-fulfilling prophecy. So if Trump is elected in his first 100 days, makes a set of policies that leads the markets, the capital markets, the business markets, the consumers believe that things are going to better, be, that believe that things are going to get better, then we may see a bump in enthusiasm, and we might see the real estate market pick up significantly then, and we would get what I'm calling the Trump bump. Now, am I right? I don't know. It's just a gut feeling. We have a long time before the election is going to occur and could we have another candidate from the Democrats? Could Biden get reelected if he stays in? There's a lot of questions. But I wanted to lay out to you that one possible outcome is Trump getting elected and what could happen if he put the right policies in place. So I'd like you to think about it. And if you'd like to discuss it, or if you have any questions about your particular situation, let me know. Contact me and in all the ways that you can reach out to me and I'd be happy to help you. And I just hope and pray that this isn't taken as a political endorsement or anything like that and my messages blow up and I get all the negative feedback that I've heard people get over time. So thanks for listening and if I can help you, let me know. Thanks so much.